Hi everyone, my name is Naro Wan. I'm so excited after watching a pretty cool board made by Leopard Imaging today. I want to share that excitement with you with this video. Are you curious about the board? Let me show the board. This is the board. Mmm, so nice. This is a really cool board. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, <laughs> you cannot see. This is the board. This is too small, right? So cute. Hmm. This small board. I'm really curious about this small board, what it can do. Okay, are you curious? Let me explain a little bit more about this board. Connect this board to PC through the uh, serial cable. And this port is audio line out and uh, audio line input. And this port is uh, JTAG plugins. And JTAG can be used to develop non OS version or real time OS development with using Cold Composure Studio. And uh, this one is SD card slot. Of course, you can plug in SD card here, or you can plug in wireless network card here. Then this port will be connected through the wireless network. And uh, this one is a USB port. This port can be powered through the USB cable. But some notebook PC cannot support sufficient power through USB. For that case, this board also have the 5 volt power jack here. And this is a TV video output. So you can easily connect this board to the TV and you can enjoy video through the, uh, the TV. And uh, this board can be plugged out like this. And if you need a uh, different resolution, then you can easily ex exchange this image sensor board with uh, the different resolution image sensor board. And the Leopard imaging they are developing another daughter board which has component input and composite input. So with using that daughter board, you can easily get the video input from DVD player or Blu-ray DVD player. And uh, this is the main processor of this board and uh, it is the reason why I'm so excited with this board. This main board is using the TI processor, DM355. I'm working for TI. The DM355 has ARM9, 260 MHz, and it has dedicated MPEG-4 JPEG hardware accelerator. It means when you run the MPEG and JPEG codec, full ARM MIPS can be utilized for running other softwares and the DM355 has a lot of the integrated peripherals so as you see this board is pretty simple but it supports almost all necessary things okay now let's see this small cute board what it can do uh, with a real demo so I turned on this board with connecting power here and uh, this board connected to network with this Ethernet cable. And my notebook PC also connected to network with this cable. Then on my notebook PC, I turned on Internet Explorer. And Internet Explorer is showing the transfer video from this board. So now can you see? So this image sensor board captures the raw video and the DM355 compresses that raw video to MPEG-4 then compressed video go to through the this network connection then transfer video reach it to my PC through the network then in, through the Internet uh, Explorer and I can see the transfer video Hi did you enjoy the demo? This board is very small, but it can do a lot. It depends on your creative ideas. The price of this total system very near to $100. Is it attractive? So please stay tuned. 
it will come soon. Okay, thank you. Bye.